With six, city commissioners are set to discuss the designation of part of Tallahassee as a state brownfield area. According to the EPA, a brownfield is a property where reuse, redevelopment, or expansion of it is complicated by potentially dangerous contaminants. The contaminants come from the property's original use for things like gas stations, auto repair, and metal recycling. And the goal of Tallahassee's brownfield program along Blake Bradford and Spring Hill Roads is to redevelop the south side of the city to grow the local economy. Right now, the city first needs to designate the portion of the road as a commercial zone. This change would give potential developers easier access to clean it up. The city hopes this change will create more jobs, redevelop the area, and fit right along the Blueprint Intergovernmental Agency's Airport Gateway Project, which we've told you about. That's set to improve transportation in the city by 2028. The city will make the decision on changing it to a commercial zone at the commission meeting happening tomorrow at 3 in the afternoon. And the EPA says the reuse of brown fields benefits communities. According to data from 2022, residential properties can increase by up to 15% in value. The tax revenue can range from 300 from 30 million to around 100 million dollars, and residential vehicle miles traveled can decrease by 10%.